Three, two, one, go. The challenges of the steel bridge competition are they change rules on us every year. So each year it's a new fresh idea that they, come, that they come out with. So we need to sit down and design an actual new bridge. So it's, it's an actual engineering competition because you sit down and you actually design something on a computer and then you think about, well, can this actually be constructed? And we go through uh, long hours designing that and thinking about, will this work? And then if it does work, we actually go out and we actually make the bridge. So it's actually, you see it from on paper what the rules are, how big it can be, to going onto the computer and saying, sitting down and designing it, to going to an actual product and then testing it at the end. Andres Manufacturing is in Wanakee and uh, they allow us to come out and bring our team members out and use uh, their shop tools because they have more extensive and better tools than we are available in our, in our lab on campus. So they let us come out here, we order steel through them and it comes in 20 foot sections generally. So we need to cut it down to usually under a three foot length so we use their saws and their grinding tools and stuff like that. And then once we get it all oriented right, we ha they donate one of their welders time to us. So they give us a guy uh, for a week and he will go ahead and do all the actual structural welding for us. It's a donation, you know, they donate my time. The they don't necessarily have the facilities where they're at to do what we do. And for me, it's a nice change. Andres Manufacturing has been helping us out for, uh, I believe, the past 10 years. They're always very willing to help out with anything, and the uh, professionals that they have here help us out with some of the design. If we see an issue in our, in our design that we didn't think of that can't be made by the welder, uh, they'll sit down with us and, be, and try to present some alternatives to us. Students walk away with a lot of knowledge about learning the different computer programs that, for analysis of structures and also getting good at creating shop drawings and fabrication drawings. Then they also come out and they get actual shop experience, you know, cutting and grinding and doing some welding if necessary on some of the pieces. And then also they get experience putting it together and, doing, and running an actual load test, so it's, it's a lot of fun.